Good day. My name is Miles Steyli. I'm a senior product, parametric product manager at Celsius Pro, which is a Swiss-based company specialized in designing customized parametric products and providing platform solutions to insurers and risk aggregators. Today, I have the great pleasure to give you some background and insights about the support and services Celsius Pro has been providing under the Kenyan Livestock Insurance Program, in short, CLIP. So this picture shows you the entry portal for the defined stakeholders like Appa Insurance Company, who has access to the NDVI dataset, including Celsius Pro Environmental Monitoring System that visualizes and analyzes the data in various shapes and forms. Celsius Pro is APA's service provider for A, the index calculation, and B, the policy lifecycle management. The latter is being administrated within Celsius Pro white labeling platform, which, is autom which automates the main steps like the issuance of master policies or cover notes for the individual beneficiaries as well as the loss settlement process. So let me give you a short overview what this scheme is about. This scheme has been endorsed by the Ministry of Agriculture, Livestock and Fishery with the intention to implement an insurance program which covers the livestock of the farmers in certain areas in Kenya. The national government pays, at least in the beginning, 100% of the premium and this insurance policy covers uh, up to five tropical livestock units uh, which belong to exposed farmers. It is a so-called micro and meso insurance scheme which is being which is administrated by APA insurance company. The index has been defined as a vegetation index, which is an NDVI, which stands for normalized difference vegetation index. Which is an index which which um, estimates, so to speak, the greenness of the grass in a numerical way. It is a proxy for the expected pasture yield, which obviously is an indicator of forage for the animals. The index and loss settlement and the policy life cycle management is being provided by Celsius Pro. With all the output coming out of those systems, uh, APA is obviously then making the payments directly to the accounts or through the mobile payment system to the beneficiaries of this program, if, of course, there is a loss. The program has been launched in October 2015. It started off uh, on, or in two countries, covering 26 insurance units, which are, which are seen on the slide on the right hand side is a different colors. So these are the insurance units in two counties. The policy is being designed to cover the full 12 months, which is then being split um, into short rains and long rains. Um, the short rains are going to go from October to February, whereas the index calculation is going to happen end of December. And for the long rain, which goes from March to September, where also the index calculation is being uh, done in the middle, so to speak, in June here. The, cover, the, 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 the program has been covering uh, 5,012 farms in the first year. It was a success, and obviously the government designed it uh, to uh, expand the program or renew the program. It expanded it uh, to, from two to six counties, now covering 17 insurance units. Um, the first season has expired in December, 
and uh, you might have seen and heard and maybe even experienced that there has been a severe drought in that rainy season. You're going to see uh, the many black colors, uh, you know, indicating uh, the, covered, the covered areas and obviously the losses which the farmers suffered in, in, those, in those regions. Here, I must say that um, I would like to mention also that, uh, you know, black means obviously that uh, the index has fallen between 0 and 20 percent, which obviously, according to the policy definition, triggers an event and makes a pay payout to, uh, to the individuals. Um, there has been, during that drought, uh, 80 percent of the units has been, has been affected and uh, losses has been paid to the farmers uh, feeding over 50,000 50, 50, animals. Um, during this second cover period, there has been 12,000 or still are 12,064 farmers covered. Moving on, the platform provides as a, um, for, for, the, for the upper, uh, obviously the various tools or methods to um, calculate or to track the, 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 the index, the index. I would like to show you here as an example for Tokana, the time series of the last three seasons. You're going to see uh, how the index, the NDVI index has been uh, evolved over the years, over those three periods, um, indicating that obviously the, the first two seasons haven't triggered because the index at the dash green line has been above the 20% level. Whereas in the last short rain season, the index dropped below the 20%, which obviously made then all, uh, all the losses. Another way to, um, to see the, uh, the, the past conditions of the insured seasons or units is in the way, as you can see here, which is uh, nicely visualized. Uh, in all the covered areas, you can actually, you know, go back in the beta in the database uh, back to whenever the index started into around 2001, and see um, uh, the various uh, the various settlement of uh, of the indices in, in in the different insurance units. Coming to the end, the lessons learned, recommendation, as you have seen, um, the visualization is obviously a powerful tool and uh, obviously also promotes and helps the education understanding amongst the, amongst the, uh, the various stakeholders involved in the, in the design and uh, implementation of such programs. So the stakeholders going to get access to that, that data, have their own logins, going to go into the system, can actually see, you know, uh, for further product design, you know, how the thing has been evolved in the past, but obviously can also see how the index is currently evolving by tracking it uh, on a day-to-day -day basis, for instance. The platform solution minimizes the operational risk and increases efficiency. So you can imagine that uh, there are many policies being issued and obviously also these cover notes, as I mentioned before, that needs to be notified to the, uh, the beneficiaries. So that always comes out of the system that obviously uh, makes the whole, the, whole, um, the whole process very efficient. I'd like to mention that uh, if you're going to set up a program like this, that it is important that not just uh, uh, you know, comes from the donor, that the intention comes from the donors or the private, but also the government is being involved in the beginning. So it needs to be that kind of collaboration mentioned earlier that um, uh, that those various stakeholders uh, need need uh, uh, need to come together and obviously promote uh, and obviously at the end of the day implement such a program. The product design has been has been done in a very smart way. I would say, as I mentioned before, it is has been designed with the intention such that the index is going to settle in the middle of a season. That obviously. Uh, gives uh, the government uh, immediate access to cash buying forage and obviously with that they can avoid paying then the dead animal at the end so that is a very good a very good thing the way this has been designed however the loss payment doesn't guarantee that uh, forage is being available 
after event uh, in a severe situation like the one experienced uh, last season. It has shown that uh, the distribution of forage obviously becomes an issue within those covered areas. And here, a recommendation is definitely that the government is going to take over certain responsibilities or additional responsibility, like, for instance, uh, coordinating the distribution of such, uh, after such, after such a, a loss event. Overall, the experience has been extremely positive from the CLIP program. Uh, it has been positive in a way that uh, other countries or governments have been looking at that and uh, are also now being encouraged to replicate this or a similar program for their for their area. So this is now brings me to the end of the presentation.